Hey guys, Julia Jordan, your favorite real estate agent. So we just traveled from like almost Pinehurst area, 249 all the way up. And now we're back in spring. And guess what? This beauty, remember I sold her last year. It's my, my former own property. And funny story, the per person that bought it is an agent as well, but from a different area in Texas and very busy with other business adventures. So he's like, you know what? I have a vacancy. Can you rent her for me or can you sell her for me? And I'm like, yeah, I can do both. And let's see where we have a bite first. And guess what he said? He's like, okay, whatever price you say for rent, whatever price you say for sale, just send me over the documents. He signed the, everything like ASAP, like transaction from heaven, um, signed everything right away. And this one here is the locksmith exchanging the locks. So as he's remote, it was a little bit tricky for him to get access to the property. Keys are locked in in the property and the last key is out of state. So we organized the locksmith and he's exchanging the locks right now. And there we go with my listing sign again. You know, I, I sold it and it's always like with a little bit of a heavy heart when you take out your listing sign for the last time and the property is sold. You will not rent it anymore. It's not yours anymore. You get your money and you run. And it's a little bit emotional and it's so funny. Here we come. Black Beauty is loaded with just another listing sign. That one will go up in Umbo. So today is one of those days where I'm like all over the map. Pinehurst, Spring, Humble, Downtown, Galleria, and then all the way back up. So no, so we have listings right now all over. Uh, just finished one in Energy Corridor, very good. And uh, we have several coming. I have seven listings appoint listing appointments that I'm uh, just that I just received this week and getting ready for. Last night I pulled the all eveninger till 11 p.m. to get all my stuff done and to feel ready and set up for the day. And then this morning I did my office work and then I hit the road in the rain. It was raining cats and dogs. We could had to drive on 99 only 50 because you could literally not see anything. So you guys stay safe and stay dry and stay warm it seems the freeze is over i'm very thankful for that now we need to get over the rainy german weather and then we are good for summer hopefully okay you guys call me if you anything have you have anything regarding real estate where you need answers or need my help okay 832-444-4923 let me <laughs>